Hello and welcome to MZ Academy. This is Moes and today we're going to be learning how to find the volume of pentagonal, hexagonal, and octagonal prisms. So let's get started with this hexagonal prism. So volume is going to be big B times the height and big B is just the base and to find big B since the base is a hexagon we're going to multiply or we're going to distribute the 6 to the apothem which is 8 and the side length which is 10 and then multiply that by 0 0.5 and this will make one triangle and there are six of those in a hexagon so that will give us the base so 8 times 10 is 80 80 divided by 2 or multiplied by 0 0.5 is 40 40 times 6 is 240 so big B is going to be 240 okay now we have found this now we just multiply that by the height which is 20 volume equals 240 times our height which is 20 and that gives us a volume of 240 times 20 is 4 um, 4800 4800 okay let's move on to our octagonal prism and volume is going to be big B times a height and it's the same thing except we just changed how many triangles there are so there are eight and we just changed the dimensions so big B is going to be um, 8 distributed to um, 4 which is the bottom times 2 times 0.5 and then we solve for this which and we would get 8 um, times 0.5 which is 4 4 times 8 is 32 so big B is 32 and now we multiply it by the height so I'll just write it down here volume equals 32 times our height which is 8 8 times 32 is 256 256 um, and then we put our meters cubed and I forgot to do it here so units cubed okay Let's move on to our pentagonal prism and volume equals big B times height. Um, big B is going to be um, the um, it's going to be five this time because there are five sides and five triangles can be made out of it. So five times our apothem, which is four, once again, times six. And then we want to multiply that by 0.5. And let's solve for this. 6 times 4 is 24. 24 divided by 2 or multiplied by 0.5 is 12. 12 times 5 is 60. So base is going to be 60. Big B is going to be 60. And then um, for the and then now we just multiply it by the height. So volume equals 60 times our height, which is 5 centimeters. So volume is going to be 300 centimeters cubed. Okay, guys, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye. Please like, subscribe, and share this video to your friends and family.